What's up everybody, BD Cool 213 here, and welcome to my Let's Play for Death Stranding. Alright, here we go. So uh, let me go ahead and set this up really quick before we get started. Just check out the controls, because uh Yeah, I only have the digital version, but even then I don't even know if the physical version actually has like a manual or something. Hide signs containing spoilers? Choose whether or not to display signs to the feature game spoilers. Signs. So, yeah, you know, I honestly, I haven't really been following this game too much. Like, I haven't really seen, like, any of the recent gameplay trailers or, uh... Yeah, I mean, like, the only thing I've seen is just, like, the first few trailers that came out for this game. But, uh, I know there was, like, a recent gameplay session thing that they did or live stream that, um... Yeah, I never checked it out, actually. <laughs> never got around to checking it out. But I was actually interested in this game, though. So, yeah, you know, I wanted to check it out because it was made by Kojima. And, of course, he made the Metal Gear games, so... Yeah, you know, I love those games, so hopefully I'll like this one, too. So we can keep our balance here. Controls for soothing BB. Motion. Oh, it's either motion or R2. Yeah, I'll do R2. Oh, wait, wait. Hold on, what else do we have? Oh, that's it? Okay, so let me see here. Uh, screen brightness. Actually, let me turn that up a little bit. Yeah, that's fine. Okay, that's fine. Let's see, HUD settings. Um, yeah, okay. We'll leave that as it is. Camera settings. First person camera. You know what? Let me turn this up a little bit. I mean, I'm sure we could probably do this in game too, but uh, yeah, I'll just get it out of the way right now. Maybe this will be fine. I'll turn it up to 75. Alright. Okay, we'll go with that. Language settings. Okay, and I want to make sure the subtitles were on for the cutscenes, of course. BB voice output. Oh, I'll set it to TV, because I'm not going to be able to hear my uh, controller speaker anyway. Wait, there's nowhere we can see the controls then? Damn, okay. Alright, well, maybe there's a setting in game or something where we can see the controls. Alright, here we go. Uh, okay, game supports auto saving. You know what? This is a new series for me, and I'm sure for a lot of people, of course, they're playing this, so I'm just gonna go with normal for the first time. Alright, let's do it. Oh yeah, so I got the uh, digital deluxe edition, so yeah, I guess I get some, some things here. Luden's mask. Luden's mask sunglasses. Armor plates, gold level two. All right, gold sounds good. <laughs> yeah, I have no idea what any of this is gonna be. <laughs> like I said, I haven't really been following this game too much recently. Yeah, I haven't seen like any uh, any of the recent gameplay trailers or live streams that they did. So I'm gonna be lost. Yeah, I apologize if I don't know the names of some of these enemies. I mean, if they did reveal them in those trailers. All right. Oh, okay. Well. Yeah, that's his, that's how I left it, I think, right? That is my birthday. Statistical analysis has indicated that Doom's abilities vary according to the sufferer's date of birth. The sufferer's date of birth. <laughs> In order to establish your own ability levels, please enter your birthday. Huh. Really? Oh, okay. Well, May 10th. Yep. Higher levels of Doom's abilities have been observed in those born under constellations such as Can Cancer, Pisces, Cetus, Delphinus, and Gygus. What about Taurus? That's me. Ah, uh, nothing for that? Well, hopefully I got a good date of birth. Yeah. I know that's the logo, but are we eventually going to wear that suit in this game? I wonder.
Once there was an explosion, a bang which gave birth to time and space. Once there was an explosion, a bang which set a planet spinning in that space. Once there was an explosion, a bang which gave rise to life as we know it. And then came the next explosion. That sucks. <laughs> he didn't make it. Okay, here we go. Recover your cargo, then find shelter from the rain. Yeah, what's up with the rain? Like, I don't know what's hap what happened to those birds there. So, wait, I could carry it on my, or grab it on my left hand, right hand, or on the back. Wait, what? Wait, I gotta hold it? I gotta hold L2? 
Really? Well, it says two out of four. Oh, well, yeah, I got one in my back, I guess. Wait, where did the rest go? What if I put it on my back? Okay. Oh, it says minimum required is one. Uh, how do I find the rest? Okay, wait a second. Oh, is that it over there? Lost cargo. Oh, wait. Some over here. I want to scan. Yeah, I probably shouldn't um, <laughs> go that way. Maybe I should find a different way. The cargo scanner, the order orderic, can scan for cargo tags. Every piece of cargo has a tag attached. All right. Well, there's one over there, I guess, or something's over there. Oh wait. Actually, there's a few things over here. Oh. Oh. Here for balance. Really? So we gotta balance ourselves too. I think I did see something like that on the in the options menu. Uh, put it on my back, I guess. <laughs> Wait, you picked up the head of distribution central, not city's drop cargo. One like receive. We we'll sometimes find cargo from abandoned deliveries dotted about the landscape. Delivering this cargo to its intended destination, in good condition, will make you very popular indeed. Really? Yeah, you know I have no idea what this game is about. So yeah, this is I'm gonna be learning right here. <laughs> yeah, as I play, I guess. Yeah, because like I said, I haven't really watched any uh, any gameplay of this game yet. So other than the first few trailers, so this is gonna be new to me. So so I guess what we're a delivery guy or something? Like, what's with the X's? Are the X's do the X's mean that I can't climb this? Well, yeah, I guess it's gonna be. Oh yeah, we could we could jump. Wait, what else can we do here? Let me see. Change posture to circle. Oh, wait a minute. Can we... There's going to be sneaking missions, I bet. What about triangle? That no, triangle doesn't do anything. Oh. Wait. Oh, this is like the first person view? Kind of like a compass, I guess. Oh, that's where we got to go. Oh, okay. And what is that? More cargo? Lost cargo. Uh, oh, there's our destination right there. So wait, we can actually see everything that's around here then? Or at least the things that we could pick up? I'll have to change the camera. Oh, kind of like in Metal Gear Solid 5. Yeah, it's the right stick. Yeah, I gotta press it in. What else? Oh, we could climb stuff. Wait, so that thing on the bottom left hand corner, is that like on the D pad or something? Oh, it is! Canteen. A stamina restoring energy drink. Monster energy. Are you... What the hell? Wait, like the actual energy drink? <laughs> Monster energy? Any timefall or other water that comes into contact with the canteen is absorbed, filtered, and mixed with the energy particles inside. The canteen has also been treated with antifreeze technology. Okay. Oh wait, it's got a level 2? So I guess we could upgrade it maybe to hold more perhaps? What about this? Oh, <laughs> yeah, I heard about this. <laughs> I did hear about that, actually. That I think that was probably in the, the recent uh, gameplay, I think. So we can urinate. Be considerate and relieve yourself away from other people and their property. Use L2 to ready and R2 to let loose. Yeah, I think now would be a perfect time to do that. Let's see, can we? Let her rip. Oh, that's it? He's done? All right. Oh, and he actually, it actually shows how much he... <laughs> like, how much he has, I guess. Alright. I guess, you know, when you gotta go, you gotta go. Okay, so wait, that's where we gotta go, so... Oh, but I'm not gonna be able to reach that. I think that's down below, it looks like. Uh, let me have a look. Way out the rain over there. Oh, okay. Never mind.
I think they're gone. <laughs> what the hell? Didn't mean to grab you so hard. Tears. A chiral allergy. So, you have dooms, like me. I've got the extinction factor. But I think you got me beat. What's your level? You can see them, right? No, but I can sense them. Level two, then. What are you doing here? Trying to stay dry. Same as you. Time falls let up. My name is Fragile. Yeah, I've heard of you. <laughs> that right? Sam Porter Bridges. The man who delivers. But it tastes like chicken. Wanna come work for me? Must be tough out here on your own. Yeah, I thought Fragile Express had plenty of people. Plenty of traitors. Not much left of us now, save for a few honest folks. And on top of that, not much left of me either. Got soaked from neck to toe. I can't help you with that. I make deliveries, that's all. This is Bridges Central Dispatch. Freelance contractor Sam Porter Bridges. Receiver is standing by for drop. Headed into town. Watch yourself. Those things never stay gone for long. The time full fast forwards whatever it touches but it can't wash everything away. The past just won't let go. I'll see you around. Sam Porter Bridges.
Well then. Oh, okay, here we go. We got a health meter now. Let's see, the blood and stamina gauges. The red bar is the blood gauge. When it reaches zero, Sam will die. The blue bar is the stamina gauge. As this gauge depletes, Sam moves more slowly and, man and maintaining his balance is harder. Yeah, I cannot wait until, uh, until I figure out what the hell is going on here. Oh wait, there's something back here, that's right. Yeah, because... I mean, when this game, uh, when they first revealed this game, and I saw, like, the first few trailers, me and I'm sure pretty much everybody else had no idea what the hell was going on in this game. And so far, I still don't. <laughs> but, yeah, I guess what they call the rain the time fall or something? Because, yeah, I saw that, um, you know, it was bringing up the plant life and then quickly killing it because I guess it was getting old or something. But I seriously hope we, uh, yeah, hopefully we find out, like, what the hell happened to this place and... Wait, what is that? Wait, is that those little flying creatures that were in that cutscene? The one that, uh, what's her name? Oh. Okay, hold on. That, what's her name, uh, eight? Uh, fragile? Or fragile? Eat crypto bite. What does that do? Oh. Ah, uh, okay. What, is it randomly gonna start playing music, I guess? Okay, so I guess if I don't hurry, they go away, but I don't even know what the hell those things do anyway. I mean, the girl ate one, so maybe might be fine, I guess. Alright. There was something else down here, wasn't there? Yeah! Alright, I guess I gotta go this way. Oh, wait, hold up. We got another uh, another option here. Loot and mask sunglasses. Oh, is this what I got? Got for uh, pre-ordering the uh, digital deluxe edition, I guess. Is this sunglasses? Okay, sure. I'll keep him on. Yeah, I don't want to get that uh, that time fall or that rain in my eyes, I guess. Alright, hold up. But yeah, seriously, I think the only person that knows what's going on in this game is probably Kojima. Or I'm sure it's Kojima. Uh, I'm sure the people that worked on this game do have no idea what is going on in this game as well. I don't know, maybe they do. Maybe they might. So wait, what happens? Do I fall or something if I don't uh, keep my balance? Alright, this water is safe, right? The endurance gauge appears above the stamina gauge. When performing actions that wear on Sam's body... Or when performing actions that wear on Sam's body. When the gauge fully depletes, Sam can no longer bear his load. Be sure to take a break before this, ha before this happens. Oh, okay, I see. I got it. Alright. So yeah, I guess the objective set to get at least one of these uh, care packages or whatever, these uh, supplies. I'll put it on my back, I guess. Total now, three out of four. Oh, wait. Oh, I mean, it did say we only need one, but where's the fourth one? Gonna be straight ahead? Yeah, because how far do we... How do I bring up this... Oh, yeah, here we go. Yeah, I guess that's where we gotta go. Alright. See, I'm trying to figure out what these little icons mean, or, uh, yeah, like when I do that. There's like these yellow markers, these blue dots, and then these red X's. Yeah, what's up with the red X's? I actually thought that meant that I couldn't climb this, but... Yeah, it looks like I can. Oh, here we go. Uh, wait, are we supposed to go there? I mean... Is that the way to take us to the objective, or can we go this way? Well, there's something up here. Oh, yeah, and running is depleting my stamina gauge a bit. <laughs> I like that little urinate meter. Oh, it's lost cargo. Keeping balance in a river. When you center your balance while in a river, you'll be able to resist the flow of water. If you center your balance with both hands, you'll be able to hold on for longer. Oh, okay. Oh, wait. There's that again. Oh, did I mess up? Wait, did I have to hold the button down as well for that? I pressed square, but, uh, well, nothing happened. Okay. Was that the optional stuff, or was that the last one that I needed? Yeah, for the uh, main objective, I guess. I mean, is there a... Oh, here we go. 
Okay, let's see. So left hand action is L2, right hand action is R2. Call out. It's the uh, the touchpad. Okay, so that's the compass mode, what I was doing earlier. L1. Scan terrain, hold breath. Hold breath. Select equipment, select items. Cargo, posture, perform action, jump. Keep climbing, move camera. Hmm, okay. So yeah, it says deliver one or more consignments of smart drugs. I said there's four of them, but I, I have three at the moment. Oh, okay, well, let's call out. <laughs> Wait, let me go this way, just in case if maybe we have to go over here to get to the objective. That, or maybe I'll find the other cargo, I guess. Yeah, I'm not sure what the range on this thing is. Oh, oh, there we go. Okay, that's the last one. Yeah, because I said there was four, but what if there's something... Wait. Is that where we gotta go? I thought it was over here. Or was this what I was looking at? Oh, no, no, wait, 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 wait. Oh, it's this thing right here. And that's, uh, more cargo? It is. Oh, can I even get to that? Is that, like, on the other side of the mountain, or is it... Oh, no, it is up there. Okay. Yeah, I thought that was on the other side of this mountain over here. Uh-oh. Wait. <laughs> uh, oh, wait, I should be able to go this way, right? Oh. Keep my balance, I guess. Yeah, so wait, do we drop the cargo or something? Because, um... Uh, it didn't mention something about, uh... About the cargo taking damage or whatever? Alright, let's see. So I guess I gotta keep my balance in the water not to fall or whatever. And I gotta go for that up there. Actually, I kinda wonder if there's more stuff. Uh, wait. So that over there behind it, that's the... That's not our destination, is it? Try standing still. Oh! Oh, okay. If crossing a river is draining your endurance gauge, try standing still. I was about to say, because I'm like, I'm not sure if I'm going to make this. <laughs> yeah, I've still got to keep going, and I'm running out of uh, endurance. All right, but yeah, we can stand still, and, uh, and then we'll be fine. Damn it, he's going slower, too. I can still put this on my back. Oh yeah, but that's that's the last one that we needed. Ah, right, let's go get that up there. Maybe we'll get something good out of it. But I kind of wonder if he's if he's gonna be able to climb this because he's got a, quite a lot on his back. Oh, okay, no problem with that. But yeah, I seriously can't wait to play more of this game. You know. And completed. Hopefully, we get like some answers of what happened here and what's up with the rain or the time fall, as they call it. Yeah, hopefully, we don't have to wait for like the sequels, like Death Stranding 4 or Guns of the Patriots, to find out what happened. Like the true story. They better not do that. I mean, they might, maybe. Yeah, because I'm sure this game is going to do pretty well. I'm sure it's going to sell well because, I mean, it's Kojima, of course. Ah, I'll put it on my back. Too. Oh, carrying too much cargo. Carrying too much cargo will make it easier to lose your balance. If you find yourself swaying left or right, use L2 or R2 to shift your weight in the opposite direction and recover balance. So, it's, yeah, it's, that's what I kind of figured. It was going to be a lot harder to walk, I guess. Alright, could there be anything else around here? So that's where we got to go over there. And I guess, I guess that's it? Wait, hold on. Oh, yep. Yeah, I was waiting for that to come up. Alright, we're good. No, I gotta say, this game looks pretty nice so far. Yeah, looks pretty good. Can't wait until we get some action. Offloading cargo. Carrying too much cargo will make it harder to maintain your balance. If same balance becomes too difficult, try using triangle to offload cargo from your back and line your load. I don't want to do that. I gotta take all this cargo with me. Okay, yeah, we're good over here. 
Uh, I'm not running right now, am I? Oh no, now I am. <laughs> yeah, I wasn't. Yeah, let me see if there's something else. Huh. Could that be it? Yeah, because we're pretty close, it looks like. Just you, yourself, and me. Huh? Wait, who's he talking to? Beginning oh! Scan. Cargo verified. Thank you. Oh, okay. <laughs> Yo, I thought they had like a security system or something. I'm gonna start shooting at me. Alright, here we go. Okay, this looks pretty even. We should be able to run, right? Yeah, without having to worry about losing our balance. Speaking of which, I gotta pee. <laughs> I was kidding. Actually, I kind of wonder if it'll warn us before, uh, you know... I guess well, we really have to go. Yeah. Alright, here we go. Nice and easy. Don't fall. Holding down buttons. Oh, okay, so I did have to hold the button for eating that little flying creature thing. When you see the icon, you will need to hold down square. Try holding it down until the delivery terminal responds. Note that you will also need to hold down buttons other than, than square. Okay, yeah, that's what I thought. Alright. Make delivery. Deliver requested cargo and cargo dropped by others. Okay. Okay, we got we got the four smart drugs, even though we needed one. Partial delivery empty, and then I think this was the other stuff that I picked up. Yeah. Okay. Well, let's confirm it then, I guess. What took you so long? It's not like the legend to come in late. Had to wait out the storm. Lost my bike. Sounds like you've been through the ringer. Luckily, our goods are in perfect condition. Well, you did keep us waiting, but everything else seems to be in perfect order, so... Great work. We'll be awaiting the next delivery. Also, this is the room where, um... You know, I heard about Conan O'Brien and Jeff Keighley being in this game, and yeah, I think this is the room where you see them, like as a hologram or whatever that was. Yeah, I did hear about that. I mean, everybody was talking about it on Twitter. So we get Facebook likes for this? <laughs> what the hell is this? Yeah, is there no map? I mean, I see a map in the back. That's the uh, route I took. Nice. Awesome. S rank. Okay. I guess that's good. Well, yeah, S rank is good, but... All I did was pick up cargo. <laughs> so do we use these likes for something, or is it just for... Uh, just for bragging rights? There's gonna be other people I'm gonna talk to that I have to show off, show off how many likes I got. That's a lot of likes, jeez. Okay. Oh. Oh. Is this for increasing our skills, I guess? The likes? Oh, yeah, it looks like it's... Yeah, it's filling up the meter there. Huh. Okay. Well, I guess I should pick up as many things as I can, I guess. Is that what this game is? A delivery game? <laughs> Bridges corpse disposal. Sam Porter, I presume? Right. 
Not the touchy-feely type. Takuma said you had some kind of phobia. Bridges corpse disposal? What happened? Look, gotta get a move on. I'll explain as we go. Come on. Come and take a look. He's got a date with the incinerator. How long since he flatlined? We don't know the exact TOD, but I'd say it's been upwards of 40 hours. He wasn't quarantined. Not sick. This is a suicide. Oh, Jesus. We're just lucky we found him at all. Got him on ice ASAP, but who knows when he'll go necro. Where are you taking him? Uh, close to incinerators to the north. This route's crawling with BTs. Sure you can't use another? I wish I could, but there's no time. Then just burn the poor bastard right here. You put all that Kyrillium in the air so close to town? Can't do it. Better that than trying for the incinerator. Hey, we can do this. We just need someone like you with dooms. Well, he's already in the first stages of necrosis. If we don't hurry, this place is a crater. So how about it? Can we count on you? Then Bridges hereby enters into a contract with Sam Porter. Sam. Just Sam. And I can't spot BTs. Just sends them. That's why we came prepared. A bridge baby, huh? With its help and you, we'll be able to stay one step ahead of them. Makes me feel like shit every time. Well, you are plugging into the other side. Freaks me out, too. Roll out! Seriously, can't wait to find out what the hell's going on here. Norman Reedus and the baby fetus. You know, the world was different when I was a kid. America is a country. Anybody can go anywhere they damn well please. No need for couriers like yourself. You get highways. Airplanes. Hell, you could even visit other countries. Hard to imagine it now. As you can see, the Death Stranding poked us full of holes. Fucked us beyond all recognition. And if you were lucky enough to survive, the time fall came and washed you away. Then those freaks from the beach showed up. Worlds of the living and the dead all mixed together. And that's when folks started holing up in the cities. Couriers like yourself got put up on a pedestal. Son of a bitch. Rainbow! Further to the incinerator. This guy's about to pop. Shit. We're gonna have to cut to the BTs. The hell?
installed. These assholes got us right where they want us. Get us out of here. Sam, can you see anything? No, nothing. BB must be busted or something. Wait, what is that that's going upwards? Like a black line.
<laughs> Seriously, what the hell is going on here? Just falling down, my fair lady. Repatriation. Sam is a repatriate, meaning that he can return to life from the place known as the Seam when killed. In the Seam, follow the strand to guide Sam's soul back to his or soul to his body and bring him back. Wait, he died? Uh Okay. Wait, what's that down there? Oh, is this like a regular scan? So I guess I have to go back to...
once there was an explosion. A bang which gave rise to life as we know it. And then came the next explosion. An explosion that will be our last. <laughs>